guys go through and say your name and how old you are and what you find them? I'm Shane. I'm 15 and I'm playing guitar. I'm James. I'm 17 and I play the keyboards. I'm James. I'm 16 and I do vocals. I'm Rich. I am 15 and I do vocals. I'm CJ. I'm 14 and I play guitar. I'm Ian and I play drums. Okay. Uh, 16. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have to do this. How did your band become? What is it? Well, I can answer that. Well, basically, DJ was in the band, and then he asked me if I wanted to be in the band with him. So then we started studying up. What? Well, yeah, I asked him to join a band because I we were originally in a band together, but I left, and then I asked him if he would come with me. And then basically, once James joined, all the other members kind of came in. So we go friends from like school, or how do you want to know? I know him through a friend, and he's always been my friend. Yeah. And uh, I know Richie through a bunch of other people. We and went to our first local show. Yeah, we went to our first show around here together. Uh, I knew Shane from Richie. Uh, and I knew so you guys are like, it's like a great fun time. Yeah, we exactly. all, all knew each other through different. Okay, that's really cool. Um, so how long have you been together as a band? How long have you guys been? A year? About since September 2011. Okay, I'm dating. Um, and so were you, you're all wearing bands before this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, um, who writes your songs, music lyrics, all that? Uh, I'm all of us, basically. I'm the most recent writer, I guess. Yeah, it's like, I, I, I write all the lyrics. We write the music together, but as far as lyrics go, it's more than just I wrote a couple. We all pitched it. Just everybody tried. Shane or a couple. We all tried. We're not all good at it. We all tried. We tried. That's good. Um, okay, each of you have to answer this individually. What song of yours is your favorite? <laughs> oh God. And what? And why? Oh God. We're all the same one. Uh, it doesn't matter. Okay, that's fine. I really are a new song called. Why? Yeah. It? It's because it's just on top. Right? Oh, it's so it's this is awesome. so different. This is my most fun. <laughs> because it's fun to play. Okay. And you agree? Yeah, I agree it's a lot. I'm gonna be the one in this group to not say I love our song decisions. Oh, I was gonna say that. Yeah. It was our it was our first single. I love all of our new stuff. Like he sees every day, and that's my problem. Can you not? Okay. Oh um, just like literally. It, it's been well, it was like the very first song we wrote together again. And if it had like our the message of the band before we became a band was you know, all positive and stuff. You know, we don't realize that how it happen that you can't just stay positive that that's like a complete lie to yourself. So, but it just has so much energy to it. That's why it's my favorite song. I mean, the, the last one. I'm gonna say Coffin because like that's one of the songs when I joined. I had pre-written from my last band and that felt weird a few weeks ago. Um, so I just kind of went to James show it and he asked me to join. So like it's basically this coffin is a song. Kind of what if your old band sees this? Because I'm not you and I'm not. No, I'm not. Damn. Oh, it's that. Wait, what? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Check the top speed. Hey, what? Hey, what? Hey, 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 hey. I'm trying to answer my question here. Okay. I like to see her a lot just because um, I really like the chorus a lot. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Andy, you have a question, or are you? <laughs> 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 Do you think I'm reading? Can I say it? Aww. Oh, me too. That's cute. Oh. I like both brothers. Thank you. We are not there. I wouldn't have to say. <laughs> <laughs> Probably decisions. That's how much energy it has. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Him. We, <laughs> and then we group of, like, I, I don't want to say fans because I'm your uncle band, 
But uh, we, we love them. They're, they're our, like really good. Uh, they're followers. Yeah. That, like they they support us a lot and they do a, like a lot for our music. Like they'll share our page. Like our friends and like our next. Yeah. They're like uh, we have a lot of good band friends. We made some enemies, but that's what every band does. I mean, what what band are, what band are you without enemies? But um, yeah, friends. Yeah. Friends. 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 Okay, uh, what bands or artists inspire you guys in this? Can we just go with that? Yeah, we have to. Put your phone away, Ian. <laughs> what bands are, yeah, influences? I wonder if I can Probably August Burns Red. Do you remember? 100%. Uh, this is our college. Yeah, the message is the be quiet, I'd be talking still. <laughs> 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 the band that mostly takes the inspiration is the kind of and they're really big, inspired me to the writing lyrically and the advice. Um, I'm a huge fan of the Devil Wears Prada. So they stick out for me, especially with my vocals and stuff. I've always been a huge fan of my Kernica. And then this is going on a limb for me, but uh, just like live present, oh my god, I need the talking stick. <laughs> I didn't know that! Uh, the band of the Wonder Years, they're a pop up band. They're Influence on me, why? Like, they just have so much energy. So, I mean, musically, not really, but we try to talk about some things that are more close to home. Like, with a lot of people. No, we don't, we're not close to home. God damn, I know it is. They're kind of messed up. I know they are. They're so mean to me. Oh, all things. Uh, you don't really have to do the thing. I guess for influences for me, I guess it was more of the most common things they really got. I enjoy it. Uh, yeah, oh, uh, I come back. Yeah, so we're going in three, uh, one, four. We'll play for pretty much anybody. I mean, like, we're like, 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 four. I mean, like, five. Who do you think? Are you, like, the voice of five? Uh, do you have, like, a staple? Like, a voice of a generation? Yeah, anything like that at all. Well, we're not the voice of a generation. Why not? Yeah, with that being said, it's just we're trying to find anybody who can to our lyrics like we relate to them because we, as me and James, we write our lyrics as much for ourselves as just looking for somebody that can see you open the lyrics or maybe just even find someone you can act with. Had a bad day, and you know, the thoughts come up, they, they can hopefully turn them on for a song and just go, they get it, they understand, and maybe if they can make it, that's fine. It's, we don't even, sometimes like with our new song, um, we, like with our new song often, we don't exactly write for lyrics from necessarily our, I don't want to say our name. You point out because sometimes we haven't had this people, we just go look at things from our angle and then possibly put it into a broader perspective, I guess you could say. Yeah. Like father could come off, or like a coffin could come off to somebody who's maybe lost their father in their life, or has you know has not had that father figure and maybe had issues with their father. Or like religion or anything like that. It, it can kind of relate to them in some way. Now it, it's coming from us and we wrote it about a friend okay. who doesn't have a dad in his life. So that he had he made a very Bad exit. Yeah. So that that's where that comes from. Now I mean the lyrics are kind of broad, just so they can relate to anybody. I mean this this band is full of different like viewpoints and religions and everything. So they're sort of our whole idea is just to focus on everybody just to so relate. Okay, what kind of venues or gigs do you play and what is your time? Why do you want to get a big place? Well small play and well, a lot. We played the Grange once, which is a, basically that's a big place to go. I've been there. 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 I've and we just um, wrong show. You guys might all have the same answer to this, or different ones. What's your dream venue? That would be pretty cool to play the XLI and go there and like try to find them. That's impossible. Yeah, that'd be nice. Are you My mom called me. <laughs> mom called him in the interview. I don't know what to play with magic. Yeah, um, that would be oh. <laughs> Uh, 
basically just a small room, enough for us and maybe like 50 people. It's like just half everybody's just enjoying the music. It's not really just a certain place, it's just anywhere that I can kind of like be face to face with people that I can actually relate to and actually know the lyrics. And actually I can scream to them and they can scream back the words and just have an overall good time. It's, it's a very way to connect with your fans and having a 20 foot barrier between you and them. Security guard people. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Like, 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 I want to go back to that question. Okay. Okay. Because they're going to see this. The comments are going to be I don't. I don't know. Like, like, right up with people. Like, like, space boy, big star. Yeah. Well, let's get to it. I want to play a house party. Yes. I want to play a house party. Let's play a house party. Okay. Let's play a house party. Let's play a house party. <laughs> We're up for house parties. Okay, uh, I'm not gonna make this up, but I'm not sure if you guys have like a new DJ or album. Yes. Okay. It's so many who heard about it. Tell me about it. it I'm here about it. It will have five songs. It reached me and it was released on December 12th, 2012. When the big show was released at House Around Side at School of Rock. School of Rock. So is it, it was like your second? Very first TV. Very first It's called I Refuse to Say. It's been in the making for the past year. And it's, it's got everything that we want in what I can say. We're going to finish it off this weekend. It's, it's got everything. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we could they were all really proud. We're, 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 we're all happy with it. What is your goal as a fan? Go on. For me. For me, I guess. Okay. Okay. Have fun. <laughs> it's a very good Warp Tour! <laughs> My main point is what I want to do is like, 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 to be able to like, actually, after like, playing like, a really good show, having somebody come up to me and actually having a heart to heart with them, like about how the music comes to them, and just be happy that like, my goal in music is actually to do something like that. It's not like any big, like, you know, big tour, it's just somebody that's like, really connected with. I'm with you. I'm kind of with everyone on that. Yeah, I think we all We all miss that. Thanks for that. Thanks for that. Give them the, the thanks. 
Yeah. Mom, Dad, I'll put it out. Shout out to Mom on the bed. You're the one who got me into the My dad. What I basically say is, if you're first starting out, take your time and don't let the rush in the show. Make me recording a little bit. I like to run. Yeah.